Now, we can use hydrogen for our transportation and so on, and I need a, a volunteer to come down and help with this, please. Um, yeah, right on the end there, why not? If you, yes, would you like to come forward, please? Right. Okay, sorry, what's your name then, please? Sophia. So, Sophia. Okay, right, now Sophia is going to launch a rocket here. We have a rocket at the back filled with hydrogen and oxygen, and Mark's going to uh, give you your safety equipment. I'll just explain what's going on here. So the rocket here is filled up with hydrogen and oxygen, and in a moment we're going to put an electrical spark across there, which should, I hope, send our rocket across. So we'll have a countdown from three. Okay, three, two, one. Oh. Well done, very good. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now, obviously, that was rather a small rocket. Here's a larger rocket. This is the space shuttle. But actually, the orange tank in the middle there is filled up with, well, a very concentrated supply of hydrogen and oxygen. It's liquid hydrogen and liquid oxygen. And this, when they react together, gives a lot of energy uh, and helps thrust the rocket up. The white rockets either side, well, those don't contain hydrogen and oxygen. We'll come back to those ones. But um, the blue flame that we see here, not the yellow flame, but the blue flame is the hydrogen and oxygen combining, um, forcing, helping push the space shuttle into space. Well, closer to home, 